What is going on today, guys? Stix10 here. Today, we're going to take a look, another look at Wish Cash in Great League of Pokemon Go, Go Battle League. So, here we go. First opponent here. Uh, some of the reasons I've covered Wish Cash before, and it is still good, especially in the current meta with uh, the Stunfisk boys are in there. Still can hang with those guys and beat both of them. And so that is why I have left it. Um, I kind of struggled when Great League came back trying to find a the right team that I wanted to use. And I finally found one that I think is working. And so I wanted to share with you all. Let me know what you all think in the comments below of this team. If you're using Wish Cash, let me know what you're, uh, why you're using it. Or if you're using something similar, another Mud Boy, let me know why. So here we go, Umbreon versus uh, Wish Cash. Um, definitely, uh, so this is gonna be a, uh, I believe it's gonna be foul play, there it is. And so the next one will KO me. Uh, and here I go for the Blizzard and obviously that was a mistake. Probably should have just kept going for Mud Bomb because he was pretty low. And there's the switch into Met, uh, oh, Meganium, I'm gonna catch this uh, Mud Bomb here. And we're gonna switch into our Charizard. And we're going to just uh, just get this thing. Uh, we're going to farm down, get a bunch of energy on this. So it's actually Earthquake. Okay. Uh, it does quite a bit. Uh, surprisingly, we, we do resist it, obviously, because um, of our flying type. Uh, we do block the front Frenzy Plant there. I don't know if I necessarily needed to. It would have put me pretty low, but we would have been okay more than likely. Uh, so we do shield our Charizard, so that means we are out of shields. And so here's a Dragon Claw into this Umbreon. Now, unfortunately, they had a Foul Play loaded, so this is going to KO my Charizard here. Puts me in a pretty bad position, and then I bring in uh, bring in Wish Cash, and, uh, which didn't have any health left. I should have left that as my sack swap here in a little bit. Uh, we're going to charge up. Uh, one Frenzy Plant will definitely KO. Uh, that Umbreon and we'll see what they have in the back. I'm going to over farm a little bit try to get some extra energy This is definitely where having that wish cash as a sack swap would have been a better move uh, For I thought wish cash had a little bit more health left on it though So there's the KO and then in comes oh this is bad Beedrill So the poison jab's gonna KO me there uh, GG's trainer uh, Tough battle definitely made a couple mistakes there that cost me that game uh, could have been in a pretty good position there uh, if I would have set myself up right. Uh, so Wish Cash versus Hypno. Uh, we'll see what moves they have. Uh, they usually have a punch and then a shadow ball. So we do have to watch out for that shadow ball, obviously. I'm going to charge up, throw the mud bomb here. Uh, Hypno is pretty bulky, so this isn't going to like, it's going to take a lot of those mud bombs to get it down. Uh, we're gonna hope this is an elemental punch here. Oh, it's fire punch, so that's okay um, Definitely not gonna do a whole lot of damage there uh, My guess is the next move they're gonna throw at me is gonna be a shadow ball um, So we will shield that up Now those confusions are, are racking racking up though uh, Yeah, there's the shadow ball so um, And then we should be able to right here. Uh, we've got the double mud bomb loaded Ooh, they actually spend a shield on that mud bomb. Uh, so this is going to get us... This should be pretty close to KO. Uh, yeah. Oh, they actually switch out into a Zoomeril. Um, so we're going to throw a mud bomb. I, I, I should have switched out there. Yeah, that was, that was a mistake, I feel like. So we're going to... Let's see. We're going to go in now with... I believe we're going to bring in Meganium. Uh, we'll see if they have Ice Beam. Obviously, I can withstand one Ice Beam. Um, so here it is. Yeah, there's the one, one ice beam. They should be pretty close to another one. I'm going to force the shield here. Um, they are going to, yeah, use their shield, of course, because Frenzy Plant would have KO'd. Uh, and then we're going to, it'll just be a race in the next one. I, I'll, I should be able to get to that. Uh, and they actually switch into Hypno, so that's okay. Uh, and be able to take it out there with just Vine Whips. In comes, um, Vigoroth. Uh, we're going to throw a Frenzy Plant here. This is going to do quite a bit to that that Vigoroth. And we're going to bring in our Charizard. Uh, Body Slam Bulldoze is usually the move on Vigoroth. So uh, not too worried. We can take at least one Body Slam 
we should be able to KO before they get to the next one. Um, and then we're gonna throw a blast burn here uh, into Azumarill. Uh, it is resisted obviously, but it's just gonna be enough. And we're actually gonna KO it with our Charizard. So uh, GG's, um, definitely that uh, blast burn is just a better move um, overall for damage output. Obviously it is resisted though by the water typing of Azumarill. Uh, but able to uh, do far more damage than Dragon Claw because it has stab and everything. So here's Wish Cash versus um, that uh, Escavalier. And so we're going to go in uh, we're just going to load up to a Mud Bomb. Um, trying to remember what moves Escavalier has. Oh, a Drill Run. So that does quite a bit. Um, we're going to throw a Mud Bomb here. Um, this should be super effective because of the metal typing. Uh, maybe it's just neutral. Somebody will tell me in the comments. I'm sure I screwed that up. Uh, but Mud Bomb, definitely the way to go here. Um, and then that counter is doing quite a bit to us. Uh, at this point, I'm just going to let my Wish Cash go. Uh, I'm pretty close to another Mud Bomb, but uh, they have to use a Drill Run. So actually, it was a quite a bit of energy there. And we're going to bring in Charizard. Um... I could have bring in Meganium. Uh, that probably would have been a better move. Um, we'll see how this plays out. Uh, gonna go with the Blast Burn. You can see it does quite a bit of damage there to the Polyroral. And this is gonna be an Ice Punch, I bet. Um, which is gonna be... Um, so let's go with... Uh, let's see, another Ice Punch. This shouldn't do a whole lot to me. Yeah, there we go. And we're gonna go with a... Uh, dragon breath or dragon claw here and see how that works out there we go almost takes it out and one more uh, fire spin takes it and ludicolo in the back uh, we're gonna go dragon claw try to get that last shield and then we'll bring in meganium um, we do have to watch out uh, ludicolo can't have ice beam so we will use our last shield whatever move they throw and our frenzy plant will definitely ko from this range so yeah there's the ice beam uh, other move it could have is energy ball so but more likely they're going to throw an ice beam there trying to get the the hit we would survive it but i'd rather use the shield um on that so because here comes another one so because he is running bubble so good thing we had that shield left it gets us the win there um definitely bubble ludicolo um something to watch out for kind of a fun play i like it good choice and and pretty well played there definitely ice beam was the move uh, just needed to get to one more since i had that shield uh, wish cash shiftry this is a terrible lead matchup for us um, we are going to farm up and then i think i'm going to dip out of there see i probably should have dipped out before this actually we're just going to faint okay um and that just maintains our our switch advantage I want to see if they'll switch out here. Obviously, they don't need to. Um, there's the switch, and it's into Galarian Stunfisk, and so that's okay. I'm going to go for the Blast Burn here. This is going to do super effective damage. Oh, and they don't shield it, so uh, wow. Uh, we're going to switch now to Meganium, um, and we're going to shield up. Uh, it's possible they could have... Uh, they, it is a there is a Poison-type move on... Uh, Quagsire, so we're going to uh, shield up at least that first one. See, oh, just Stone Edge again. And we're going to faint this down, and then we know they've got that shift tree. So we're going to throw the Frenzy Plant here. And then we're going to throw another Frenzy Plant. And they should be pretty close to a foul play, I would think. Oh, they don't actually shield. So, uh, wow. Okay. Um, guessing, I don't know. I thought they were in a pretty good position other than that. But, uh, we'll go on to the next battle. Uh, and we're going to go Wish Cash versus, oh, Reggie Steel. Great matchup, lead matchup for us. Um, our team does very well against Reggie Steel. Vigoroth comes in. Uh, we're going to build up some energy and then we're going to switch to Charizard. Uh, body slam right here. We're going to shield up this body slam because we're going to have to withstand at, at least another one coming in pretty quickly. He had quite a bit of energy on that Vigoroth. Uh, we're going to go Dragon Claw here. Try to get that. Okay. 
get it a little lower and then this body slam and then we should be able to just farm down um they might get to another body slam though or they're pretty close to one now yeah there it is uh, so we're gonna have to shield up if i want to survive so body slam and then we're gonna fire spin it down and just barely we have enough hp we're gonna throw a blast burn here into haunter so haunter came in this blast burn will do quite a bit if we can get it uh, they do use their la their one of their shields we're going to throw the mud bomb here and then we should have another one loaded up or pretty close to it um so this is going to do quite a bit before hunter can throw a uh, i'm sure they're trying to go for shadow ball because that would do quite a bit see super effective we get the ko reggie steel comes in and they actually quit out um realizing they're in a pretty bad position um because we still had um meganium in the back that we hadn't used so ggs we go four and one in that set uh losing that first one definitely made some mistakes in some of those games that we still won so ggs and there is our rank now we are most of the way through rank eight uh, hoping to get to nine this season as always i want to thank my patreon supporters link in the description down below and if you guys haven't already check that out also like comment subscribe and keep on battling